We're here today to discuss a new groundbreaking clinical investigation into establishing the role of lactulose testing using the GastroCheck gastrolyzer to measure methane production um, and how it evolves over 20 weeks in patients with functional constipation on treatment. Leading the study is Gastroenterology SPR, Dr. Leonard Lee. Can you give us some more background into this study? We're looking at a condition called functional constipation. So functional constipation is a disorder of the gut and it's characterised by severe constipation. Patients are only going to the toilet maybe once, maybe twice a week and they get a lot of stomach pains, cramps and bloating as a result of this. So the research is really based on studies which are coming out, on, out of America and they've noted that in patients with very severe constipation, they produce a lot of methane gas. And, and what we're hoping to investigate here is what is the role of methane gas testing in patients with functional constipation. What do you hope to achieve with the study results? And so what we're trying to do is to look at patients with constipation and look at how the methane gas production changes. And so as they get better, as the constipation improves, does the methane gas production go down? Um, ultimately, what happens with treatment, and finally, what happens long term with patients' methane gas production. Why have you chosen breath methane as the investigation biomarker? We've chosen breath methane testing because, firstly, it's useful in patients with functional constipation. X rays are often normal, scans are normal, blood tests are normal. But what we've noticed is that breath testing can be abnormal, and really, we're trying to work out the relevance why. The second reason why we're trying to do it is it's just from the patient perspective. It's a painless test, it's very easy to perform, it's very quick to perform, and patients quite like it. So we've picked it for a number of reasons. Why have you chosen the GastroCheck as your study apparatus? So we, we picked the GastroCheck as, the, as the, the testing apparatus for this research project because it's easy to perform, it's very acceptable to patients, and it gives us a very accurate result. If your study does indeed find a correlation between methane production and functional constipation, what do you think the impact will be on patient quality of treatment? So if this study comes up positive, the impact will be firstly, uh, we might have a more accurate way of monitoring patient symptoms with constipation. We may be able to monitor more accurately the impact of therapies, um, constipation therapies on patients with functional constipation. And I guess a major aspect is we may be able to really ex to investigate further the role of methane gas testing in patients with functional gut disorders. The study is due to start in the mid-2012, so hopefully by the end of 2014 we'll have some good correlation between methane and functional constipation.